Welcome to Think Dart. For decades, we've looked at Mars and seen lifeless deserts, dusty craters, and silent storms. But now, new evidence from NASA suggests that Mars might still harbor life, not the dinosaurs, not cities of old, but something far stranger and more persistent. What if the planet next door, cold and desolate, still pulses with microbial whispers? Tonight, we examine the latest findings, the drilling missions, the leaked methane spikes, and ask, are we closer than ever to confirming life on Mars? 1. The methane mystery methane on Mars is thrilling because on Earth, nearly all methane is produced by life, microbes, cows, or decaying vegetation. NASA's Curiosity rover detected seasonal methane spikes in the Gale Crater, peaking in northern summer. Why the seasonal pattern? Could microbes be stirring underground only when the sun warms the ground? Some scientists suggest geological processes, reactions between rock and water, create methane. But the repeatability, the patterns, mimic living organisms' behavior. As we speak, the ESA's ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter is counting Eastern Hemisphere spikes, waiting to confirm if methane is local, repeatable, global, or something else. 2. The organic molecules in ice in 2022. Perseverance drilled into Jezero Crater's bedrock and brought samples back to Earth, via caching rover. Analyses found complex organic molecules, carbon-based compounds essential to life as we know it. But these molecules can form abiotically, too. Still, they appear in patterns, layered deposits that suggest deposition in ancient lakes. Could these organics be remnants of Martian microorganisms? Or just chemical traces left by drying water? Either way, we're holding a puzzle piece that could shift our entire understanding of biology. 3. Subsurface water. The possible aquifer radar from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter hinted at a bright reflector under Mars's southern polar ice cap, something that might be salty liquid water. If true, a subsurface aquifer could provide habitats shielded from radiation, heat from below, and enough liquid water for life. Terrestrial extremophiles live miles underground, in darkness, heat, and brine. Could Mars be home to similar extremophile microbes? Skeptics counter that radar reflectors might be clays or permafrost. Confirmation requires direct sampling. Yet, the possibility of liquid water today sets hearts racing. 4. The mysterious glints from Mars orbiters have spotted fleeting, bright glints on the Martian surface, too fast to be reflections from ice. Some interpret them as dust geysers, sudden outflows of gas that vent light briefly. Others theorize they're caused by tiny living organisms, releasing gases or moving. Controversial, yes, but remote cameras caught glints repeating in the same regions over multiple Martian days. The patterns hint at behavior, not random reflections. 5. Meteorite life? ALH 84001 revisited in 1996, scientists claimed microfossils inside ALH 84001, a Martian meteorite on Earth, might be evidence of ancient Martian life. The claim was widely disputed, but modern techniques, high-resolution chemical imaging, isotope analysis, now detect structures that look even more like bacteria. Still, many argue, what appears biological could be mineralization or terrestrial contamination. If the meteorite once carried life, maybe we can trace lineage to modern Martian microbes. Or not. 6. NASA's statement and AMP. Leaked internal reports in a confidential briefing, an unnamed scientist reportedly said, We have signals that can't be geological, but we can't yet say they're biological. While NASA publicly remains cautious, internal memos show excitement over data that doesn't fit known models. Leaked emails reference, unexplained methane patterns, organic layering, and the tilt of subsurface pockets. Will we ever see the raw data? Possibly, once peer-reviewed and verified. But secrecy breeds speculation, and speculation feeds our fascination. 
7. Alternate Life Theories What Could Be Alive on Mars? If life exists today, it's probably microbial, hardy, small, slow growing. Potential Candidates Methanogenic bacteria under iced layers salt-loving microbes in brine pockets dormant spores awakened by heat The ocean of possibilities includes utterly novel life forms. Ones based on chemistry unfamiliar to Earth. Some theorists propose life began on Earth, traveled via meteor impact, and seeded Mars. Echoes of panspermia If that's true, then our own biology might be extraterrestrial in origin. 8. Philosophical Implications Confirming Life on Mars, Even Microbial, Would Revolutionize Philosophy, Religion, and Science. We weren't alone. The origin of life becomes multiply instantiated, not unique to Earth. Darwin's tree gains parallel branches. Will the news unify humanity, or spark new debates? Can we protect Martian ecosystems, disturbing them with our rovers and human footprints? 9. Skeptics and caution Remember, science demands proof. Cross-contamination from Earth, instrument interference, background noise, many alternative explanations still stand. The scientific community insists on repeat sampling, cross-lab verification, and inch-by-inch -inch validation. That's how discoveries become facts, slowly, carefully. So, has NASA probably found life on Mars? Maybe. The evidence is tantalizing, layered with past whispers and future promise. Methane cycles, organic compounds, subsurface water, and mysterious glints, each could be a piece of the greatest detective story in human history. Which of these signs do you believe is the strongest clue to life? Or do you think it's all geological noise? Join the discussion in the comments, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Think Dart. Because every revelation takes us one step closer, to knowing whether we truly stand alone.